another word from God. I am the supreme being. You know they recede, don't you? It's in my word. There is less of them and more of us. The darkness increases and so too does the light. The bang. I take the light. I take the light from this world. You know he is the light bearer. Just so you know, it isn't his. Just because you carry something doesn't make it yours. The light is the stars. The heavens and everything in them were created by me. The one supreme being that begun everything and can end, end anything. So at the words final end, the stars are taken. Have a look at the way the Lord's getting me to write these things. I don't know if it's come going to come the right way around or not. Stars. The top one is our Lord. Taken. I haven't read this word yet, but goodness me. Three pass. Oh, shut up, shut up, shut up, stars. Taken. So at the word's final end, the stars are taken. See how there's uh, upside down and the right side up? This is going that way and that way, down to the pit, up to heaven. The stars are taken that way or that way. Mm, she there is a place where it turns. A place where it is transcribed. A between place I control and no one enters without a pass. And there's that word, free pass. Right to left, do you notice the film in between? That mirror image, when you see an image, like a mountain and the reflection, what's on the, what's between? Free pass, a term referred to now as a license for adultery. Have you heard that before? The Lord's reminded me when you're in a marriage and you give your partner a free pass, it means they can play around. 
But the Lord is saying, it is still your ticket. It is a free pass. Let every man be a liar and the Lord be true. The golden ticket, like in we Wally Wonka, the Wonka factory, you know the old movie? The Lord's taken me full circle. He has mentioned that last year. The old guy, the granddad and the boy, they bank everything on getting it, winning that golden ticket, that three pass, the ticket that is a curse to some because their hearts give them away. But it is a gift to others. If you watch that movie. The golden ticket. There are a few going, but most are gone. I get so hot when I give these words. Whew. <clears throat> Oh, so there is a last day for buying these tickets. Last day, the total recall when you who have won, who are the final phase, will go if you have one of these tickets. You're in the final phase. You will go. You'll travel. Ring out like a note, like that hurts, the God note, the God note, you can write this with understanding now, Lisa, yes, I do, I understand, the God note, look at Prince, he spoke about it, it comes up, it is a sound, not all has been given, just roughed out. That harks back to the roughing out of the pendant. Those who have this ticket are roughed out. They're just in the roughing out stage. It is like that 3D sculpture, yet it is a pendant, it is small, that comprises of everything. And the Lord has reminded me of the men in black, the pug, the wee dog. He carries the message and it's so small. He says it's on the cat. But it's, it says, he says it's not the cat. Cats and dogs are natural enemies. Why do they fight if not for food? They're not fighting for food anymore. They fight for power, for dominion and for victory. There's nothing wrong with that when it's a good cause to fight for those reasons when it's a good cause there's two causes there's one good one and one bad do you notice the pattern here it's opposite and backwards good cause so take your ticket your golden ticket you have a free pass free pass go 
in between as the last number come in. As the last number comes in. It's like the Lord is saying he's calling out his remnant, his 144,000. The last numbers are coming in. As you do so, does he and his travellers, voyagers, never putting down roots like I said, so you are ready, right? So I'm sure that doesn't read well, but as these last numbers come in, you will find you are like, you are travelers, you're voyagers. That's what the in-between is. Never putting down root, like I said, so you're ready. That's why he says, be ready for the coming of the Lord Jesus. Always be ready. That meant don't put down roots in this world. I told you to be ready. Few are. But you are readied by me, by my spirit, one and omnipresent. Many are everywhere. There is a difference. Never in any place at one time. How do I do this? It is not magic, the Lord says, and it, or alchemy or the alphabet. I communicate directly and instantly in a moment. Like I don't need preparation, props or costumes. I am. You have heard of me. Many will see and be with me again. Till then, the moment is ours. The moment in his time on my timeline. Can you hear what the Lord's saying there? I am. You have heard of me. Of course we've heard of him, but do we know him? Many will see and be with me. Be with me again. But till then, the moment is ours. The moment in his time, Satan's time, on my timeline. The Lord's timeline. That was on the 23rd of the 7th. 